All right, yo, 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 oh my god, my camera is so off center. The fuck? I don't think I fixed it after last stream. It's also a little bit uh, of a Dutch angle tilt, but I don't really care. It's all good. How are we doing, folks? I was streaming earlier, so I'm a little bit all over the place. Um, I'm going to try my best to not be too all over the place, because I want to play some Bully and hang out with y'all. Uh, in case you don't uh, know, Bully was released here in the U uh, UK and Ireland. I think in Europe in general, well, he was released under the name Canis Canem Edit, which means dog eat dog, I believe. Isn't it? I can't remember. One sec, Google will tell me. Oh, wait. Google, what does Canis Canem Edit mean? According to Wikipedia, Bully is an action adventure video game developed by Rockstar Vancouver and published by Rockstar Games. That doesn't help. Yo, Tartan, what's up? How we doing, guys? Yep, that's the European title, all right. Latin for doggy dog. Yeah, yeah, I knew it. Fucking knew it. Fucking knew it, yo. How you guys doing, though? Uh, I I was live earlier, and we just kind of jumped through a bunch of games. Like, we played a little bit of World of Warcraft. We played a little bit of League of Legends. We played a little bit of Overwatch. But now, I'm here to play some Bully with y'all. So I'm very excited, because... Uh, this game has a very special place in my heart. Now, it's one of my wife's favorite games. I love it. I love it a lot. Hope it's a great day. I did, man. I, I did a stream today. I'm a little bit tired. And um, this full-time streaming thing is going to take some getting used to, balancing it out, figuring my schedule out, trying to help Kathy with her streams, you know, trying to still be a fucking dad, trying to get a feature film done and all that shit. So, like, there's a lot of th shit, like, work-life work balance that I still got to get figured out. But I'm happy. You know, especially after the amount of progress we made in our um, in developing our horror game last night, that shit was insane. Now, when I launch Bully, it's going to be so fucking ungodly, unbelievably loud. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to mute voice music. You won't hear. You shouldn't hear any audio now for a sec. Well, like you'll hear me talking, but you won't hear any of the music. Also. Oh my god, very cool. In the in between <laughs> In between uh my last stream and and streaming now on YouTube, I received two uh, additional follows on Twitch, which is awesome. Huge kudos to Creatures1203 and F Fantas Mike, who is uh it's George as mod. Uh Fair Fox. Thanks bro. Thanks Fox. Yeah, Owen, uh, Sid, Tartan, how was your days? Hope you had a good day. 
I did bite my tongue earlier and hurt quite a bit. Yeah, I'm sorry to hear that, Owen. Yeah, from college, back in black. Oh, and I'm sorry, bud. Never easy, man, when you got those kind of days. I've had too many of them lately. So I fucking empathize, pal. Nothing you can do when you're in them either. You just kind of have to write it fucking out. Sucks, dude. Uh, I just need to tell my co-director from Lulu something here. Sorry, two seconds now. These contracts are for the uh, work itself, not for the right. Right. Oh, shit, did this spill all over me? Okay, so I'm trying to get the volume sorted here, which uh, you probably won't hear because I have it muted on my side. Will make you feel a be lot better. Uh, I, I don't mean to be a jerk when I say this the way I'm going to say it, but I probably will come across like one on one, and I don't mean to. But this stream can't solve your issues, you know? Um, Unfortunately. You know, unfortunately, you are going to have to, you're going to have to figure a lot of your shit out like this. You know, uh, we can help with that. We can talk to you. We can discuss it. We can figure shit out. But just, is that, that is not the bully soundtrack. Yeah, I fucking thought so. Yeah, that was weird, bro. That music was a fucking weird, um... It crashed. Of course it did. I know it didn't crash. I don't know what it's doing, though. Being a dick. I'll tell you that much. Hello? Oh, it did crash, right? Fuck me, lads. Not good. Uh, let me see here. Sorry, no folks. I'm telling you, lads, you probably don't believe me when I say this, or like a lot of people don't. They get really like, no, dude, you're just saying that, etc. Never make another film again. Really not. Hate this shit. Downloads. I know, folks.
uh, how campy it is. Fucking love, yeah. Like you say, Tartan, I love how campy this game is as well, bud. Oh, I haven't even brought us over to the game screen. I'm like going on about, oh, this, that. Like you're not even looking at what I'm looking at. Typical petty behavior. And now I've lost. Oh, there. Ugh. Fucking hell, boys. Sorry if tonight's stream comes across a little low energy. I was in a kind of good mood coming on. Ish. A bit tired, but good. But I'm just kind of all of a sudden... Kind of feeling a bit shit. Not gonna lie to you. No, I don't do that shit. I don't lie to my peeps. It looks like it's still super low res. Let's see. Where's everyone going? Bingo? It just crashed again. Is the PC port like trash or something? Because I know Rockstar do have issues with PC ports. Yeah, no worries. Thank you, Tartan. I do appreciate that, buddy. That's like the third time it's done this. Okay. We turn the music up a touch. Oh, shit. Ooh. Okay, so is the game music... No, this is the PC version. <laughs> ain't no fucking... Uh, ain't no emulation happening here. Um... It's just I know, that, again, that Rockstar are kind of fucking, well, in the past, historically, they were shit when it comes to fucking, uh, historically, they were shit when it came to, hate games that don't allow for borderless windows, or full screen borderless. Yo, thank you, Owen, I appreciate that, pal. That's, um, the new Jinx one, with Vi's gauntlet over her face. All right, let's see how we get on. Uh, I hope my mic is picking up all right. I've, uh, my boom arm is broken, so I'm now going to have to order a new boom, boom arm. So, all right, I'm just going to fucking launch into this. Everybody cool? Everybody cool? Everybody all good out there? We all feeling fine? We all feeling glorious? I don't have any coffee, which does suck a little bit, but sure, look, here we are. Also, music is a touch high, actually. Jesus fucking big doggy damn Christ. Yeah, it's grand. We turn it down and touch. Hopefully that's enough. Perfect. Alright, let's go. Let's go hang out with Jimmy Hopkins, guys. Now it's unbearably loud again. Jimmy, please say something. James? What? Who are you? Mom, I thought you told me never to talk to strangers. Like I said before, Jimmy, please be nice to your new stepfather. Fuck. Oh my god, I hate everything. Lads, this fucking game. Typical shoddy fucking rockstar port. 
Now we, we've missed the cutscene. Sucks. Oh, 100 percent time. Mom, why'd you marry that phony? What is wrong with you? What is wrong with oh, you? I can't believe this. Look at the fucking face on this you case. You must be the huh? Hopkins boy. Where'd you come from? We've been expecting you. Welcome to Bullworth Academy. Ah. Why does she have knobbly I'm knees? Sure be her knees are knocked happy. inwards. Very happy indeed. Anyway, I can't spend my life waiting around for naughty little boys. Her haircut makes I her look like a ghost. man to make happy. The headmaster is expecting you, Hopkins, in his study. Okay. His study is over there, boy, in the main building. Don't keep Dr. Crabblesnitch waiting. Crabble He's snitch. a brilliant man. What a fucking name. Brilliant. She's got girl wood for, her, for the principal, 100%. Definitely got Girlwood for the principal. Well, if you say so. Yo, what's up? Oops. I mean, literally, what? A couple of seconds. A couple of seconds into the game, and I've already started fucking World War III. <laughs> it was I, the one armed man! I don't know who this guy is. We're gonna fuck him up though, kick him right in the balls multiple times. No children for you. No children for you. This was before Red Dead Redemption 1. It was, because Red Dead Redemption 1 was 2010. I believe this came out in, I want to say, did this come out in 2006? Okay, we'll go do the principal thing first. Uh, one of the biggest mistakes I make with this game is getting bogged down and fucking everybody up before I've actually kind of even completed the prequel or the prologue thing. Hey, what's up, Phoebs? You won't escape me. What's up, Jim? You better not damage my clothes. I'm an excellent boxer, you know. Oh, good. You want to play bully? Yeah. Play. Patty just casually tossing folk into TVs and. Until they're because you are being bullied. I am. And you think you know all the folks that like in that. No. I don't remember barely anything. Do you remember barely anything? Yeah. No, you barely remember anything. Yeah, that's what I said. Alright. Don't touch that. I got locked in a closet. Oh, wow, well, that person's leg is glitching. I don't like okay now. Alright, shoo off now, Phoebes. Keep running and don't 
Have a good time playing bully. Hello there, man. Yeah, I'm such a good parent. This game, though, this game is amazing, bro. So you must be Hopkins. Uh, uh huh. What? Uh huh. What? I meant yes, sir. Very good. Now let me see. You've done a lot of naughty things, haven't you? Naughty, naughty. Graffiti, bad language. Oh no, not fucking bad language, bro. Staff. Oh, I'm scared of you, Hopkins. Come on, give me a break. Yes, I've never met a boy like you. Never in all my life. Hopkins, you're quite the nastiest little boy I have ever encountered. Tell me, why should I waste my time on you? I don't know. Because it's my calling. It's what I do. You excel at causing trouble, and I excel at fixing little boys like you. At making you into respectable members of our community here at the Academy. I've got a good feeling What's about you, What's the picture you, behind him? Two Appearing seconds. You and I are Shit, going to be oh. great friends. You keep that That's his, like, forefather, isn't it? Or I shall clean it myself. Miss Danvers, Please don't clean my yet? nose. I don't think you have the consent to do yes, that. Yes, Headmaster. And I got your tea. You I got are your good tea. to me, Miss Danvers. No more than you deserve, Headmaster. Oh, she wants the fucking Take Dean's day. Hopkins here and show him around the school and get him properly attired. Jimmy is clearly Bill Williamson's great grand grand grandson. Come along, boy. Possibly. I haven't got all that's, day. That's that's a good fan theory and as I've boy, ever seen, Sid. Remember, you will have a clean nose. <laughs> Mr. So keep it clean, or we'll clean it for you. The cutscenes in this remind me so much of GTA cutscenes, man. Like the old school GTAs. So here I am, at probably the worst school in the country. That music, I love it. Are nothing but arms dealers, serial killers, and corporate lawyers. Real scum. And uh, that old creep thinks he can tame me? We shall see, my friend. I only give people what they have coming to them. Where's your uniform, young Hopkins? Run along now, child. Here we are now, tea for everyone. Okay, I'm gonna walk casually, check this out. Not causing any trouble. Ish. That guy looks like Patrick Stump from Fallout Boy, look. Look. game is cause fucking shit lad. It just gives me way too much joy. Uh oh. Now with the boys. Oh we'll see. Fucking Conor McGregor, boys. Oh, 
Oh, let's give him a fucking nuggie. Oh, spot. Yeah. Nasty shit, bro. <laughs> Gross. You're dead. Oh you shit! Dead. It's the fucking dead. gorilla man. Hey, you, break it up. See, literally a gorilla man. That's enough of that. Break it up. Why are you not in your uniform, young man? Go change immediately. I literally just arrived at the school. Can the fuck down? Ah, oh, come on. Ah, oh, come on. I was the Ross King at the last school I was suspended from. It was a daily barbecue when I was around. Hey, you're the new kid. Yeah, what's it to this you? This guy is friend definitely a future are. Grand Theft Auto character. Loser. Hey, relax, friend. You're all pent up. This is a sociopath. So easier, they put you on medication. They did to me. Boy, nearly sent me insane. That's fascinating. Now if you'll excuse me. I said me. relax, friend. Get off, man. Listen to me, tough guy. You just arrived at the toughest school in the country, and I'm offering to be your friend. Trust me, in a place like this, you're going to need friends. So it's up to you. You gonna play nice or what? Yeah, sure. Good. So how about I? Hi, show you Gary. What's up, Gary? We don't have a bar in the door. Uh, excuse me. Hey, leave him alone. Hey, you moron. Why don't he do the way the real man shows the road? I love beating up the jocks. Beating up the jocks always gives me a huge amount of fucking joy. Because it's what I wish I could have done when I was in school. So I bought this on Steam for €3.49. I'm not sure how much it is on PlayStation Store at the moment. You should probably change into your uniform if you don't want to get in trouble. I would strongly, like, this game is one of Rockstar's finest, in my opinion, so I would strongly recommend, if you can get it cheap, definitely pick it up, man. <laughs> hey, oh, here's Petey. How you doing? You must be the new kid. I'm Pete. Pete Kowalski. Jimmy Hopkins, and don't ask how I'm doing. I've been here five minutes, and already people want me dead. Even my parents didn't hate me this quickly. Well, He's such a GTA forward. protagonist. It's a dump. Great. I've been expelled from anywhere halfway decent. Yeah, I've been expelled from anywhere halfway decent, because I'm really bad. Give up the tough guy act, pal. Hey, man, what's your problem? Well, Same. ADD primarily, Same, but also life. My parents, this school, Western civilization. But really, honestly, enough about me. Oh. I see you've met the dorm's mascot. Ladies and gentlemen, I give you Femboy, the girliest boy in school. Petey, haven't you got some imaginary friends to go annoy? Gary Don't is a alone, straight Gary. up fucking sociopath. Look like. at you. Leave me alone, Gary. I'm really self-important now that I finally hit puberty. What's your problem? I'm just being nice to the new kid as he passes through Bullworth on his inevitable journey to prison. Look, I gotta unpack. Would you guys mind getting out of here? Two ninety nine. Oh, no, Fucking no, buy it, dude. Cheat. Jimmy can't stand you already. Ugh, such. Yeah, they did. It was a uh, canis canim edit here. To be honest, they didn't play it, man, because this game doesn't reward you for being a bully. As a matter of fact, if you could play through the story, the story is quite the opposite. Like, like again, like Grand Theft Auto, you can be a maniac and you can do horrible shit. But, like, again, it's about what the story kind of gets you to do. Stay, stay away from that fucking nerd. I'll beat the shit out of you. Oh, sorry, nerd. Nerd, I didn't mean to hit you. Calm down. It was an accident, nerd. Everyone still called it bully. They called it Candace Kenny made it, but nobody called it that. Like if I was talking to somebody about this game, I'd be like, Oh, did you play bully? Yeah, yeah. Oh sorry, wrong person. Why did the game 
crash when I gave him a wedgie. Okay, it seems to be kind of unstable on Steam, by the way, Abel, because um, that's like the third time it's crashed. Let me close battle that nest. Although that shouldn't be affecting it, but still. Weird, bro. Weird, brah. Literally, because they didn't play it. I mean, it was nowhere near as um, vicious or, or, you know, do you know, the game that deserved the controversy it got was Manhunt. Because Manhunt is shock factor. By the way, I'm not sitting here saying that I don't like Manhunt. I actually think Manhunt is a fucking fascinating little game series. Um, I actually... And also, it's got some fucking talent behind it. You've got Brian Cox as the fucking the director and shit. But I just... What I mean is Manhunt, to me, was the most that was just like, Hey, guess what? I am exploitative. When's your Steam Deck coming out, uh, uh, Bill? Start from the start again. All right, I'm just gonna try and pelt through, get us back to where we were. This, if this crashes multiple times, we are just gonna have to call it, unfortunately, which I don't want to have to do. Um, but it's just Kathy's using the PlayStation because she's currently playing Days Gone over on Twitch, so I don't have the luxury of switching over to my PS5 version, which is a lot more stable. So we just have to wait and see, I guess. gonna try and pelt through back to where we was though so manhunt 2 i did play manhunt 2 had some really interesting ideas again pure exploitation there, pure absolute fucking disgusting exploitation in the best possible way ah, yeah. um manhunt 1 was a lot more of an actual like so here I am narrative the in the sense of like country. Manhunt 1 feels like a 1970s horror movie. Serial killers and corporate lawyers. Real scum. Manhunt 2 and feels like an early 2000s horror movie. Me? We shall see, my friend. I only give people what they have coming to them. Where's your uniform, young Hopkins? Run along now, child. Um, as much as any of these early, mid-2000s Rockstar games, very similar control schemes between all three. Like, between this Grand Theft Auto... You know, the Grand Theft Auto 3 for uh, pre San pre Vice City San Andreas. This um Manhunt 1 and 2. And I would even go so far as to say Red Dead 1. They all have very similar control mechanisms. Manhunt is heavily stealth oriented though. And I'm shit at stealth. But I might actually well actually, you know what? Since we're doing the Manhunt or the Rockstar games, I mean there's Ellen Noir obviously is an outlier as well. But uh Chinese burn. Nasty. <laughs> Fucking love GTA 4, including all the DLCs. I see them as one big experience rather than multiple little games, if that makes sense. I actually would say, though, that of the three GTA 4 experiences, Lost the Damned is my least favorite. I still really enjoy Lost in Them, and I hate oh, what they did on. to fucking Johnny in GTA 5. It felt like such a fucking dick move on Rockstar's part. Um, 
Ellen War. Really like to plus there's a good cast. There is a good cast. Now I do think the acting in it can veer between being really solid and really fucking ludicrous and over the top. But it was like, it felt so cheap, man, because it was literally like, oh, we're introducing this new character, Trevor, so what we're going to do is we're going to have him do this shit to a character that you, that, I don't know, I just really felt like it was such a shitty scene, man. Love Stephen Ogg. I actually enjoy the character of Trevor in the, in places uh, in GTA 5. Like, I like how he's kind of the, the perfect example of what most players of GTA are like. You should probably change your uniform if you don't want to get in trouble. Um, but yeah, overall, it was just some really edgy scenes with Trevor that I, I felt, I felt like, like you just said, they went way too far. And the fucking, hey, how you doing? The mopey face on this boy. With the driving sessions or the driving missions. The driving missions, yeah. I have issues with the driving missions in pretty much all the GTA games, if I'm being totally fucking honest with you, though. Which is hilarious, since driving is a vast majority of those games. Can't drive properly, same. Yes, let's harass everyone. Yeah, t vehicle sections and games, same. They never work for me, man. Hey, Jimmy, let me show you around. What a lightweight. Your move, Dillweed. Have you ever? Let me know. Like, what is he That's Russell's locker. You know, the big ape who almost put you in the hospital. Kneel before Russell. Next time you give four doofus. Wow, Russell, what a Come champion. On. Let's break into it, steal something. That'll teach him. Don't let the prefects see you break any rules. They'll hurt you. I fucking love GTA Chinatown Wars. I love them um, Liberty City stories and Vice City stories as well. No sign of the prefix. Chicken and salt carry. Hate that shit. Oh man! 
There's that weird chick, Eunice. Let's have some fun with her. Go, see what she wants. Okay, so like... There is going to be some offensive stuff in this game, and the reason I'm saying that is this is an early to mid-2000s uh, Rockstar game. If you expect there to not be fucking stuff that would be considered offensive, then you're in the wrong fucking place. Anything going on? <laughs> he took my chocolate! Please get it back! What? Don't push me! I feel like this is such a unique game though. Like I feel like there's very few other games that exist like this. Like it's so it's such a weird little enigma in the gaming ecosystem. Same with Ellen Ellen Noir. I think there has been more games like Ellen in War made since Ellen in War came out. But I do think that oh No judgment, bro. Baseline, bro. Feeding time at the zoo. Okay, here's the deal. Plus, some of the performance there, stuff we went the way of like course, they're it was. So it was a weird game. They look pretty harmless. They're actually sneaky bastards. Their turf is the library. Yeah, exactly, Tartan. And those are the preps. Fucking they're all prep. money and condescending attitudes. Yeah, massively inbred and completely brainless. Very observant, Jimmy boy. Now over there, greasers. The greasers. They think they're tough. Or at least try to look tough. Wouldn't advise messing with them. At least not yet. They hang by the auto shop. And last but not least, the jocks. Oh, These fuck. guys rule the school. Definitely avoid them. Whatever, I'm not afraid of some dumb roid monkeys. You'll learn. Come on, let's go. You're here Does Gary learn. have rashes on both Max Payne 3? Chef's fucking piss. It is like a, it really is a maybe that's why I love it so much. I unironically, I, I, I people don't believe me when I say this. Unironically, Mean Girls is my favorite movie of all time. I love it. I could watch it all day, every day, never get bored of it. I find it to have some of the best humor, best acting, best writing. I fucking love it. Like, from uh, people think when I say it, they're like, oh, you're being so funny that saying, I'm like, no, 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 no. Mean Girls, to me, is honestly comedy writing perfection. And you're spot on. Maybe that's why I love this game so much, because it is literally just Mean Girls, where you play as a dude. I want my big shirt back! Danny DeVito, I love your work! I love that you have to go to class and stuff. So one of my favorite things in certain games is when there's kind of mundane actions. This sounds really weird, but like it's like when I play when you play Persona. What I enjoy about it is the mundane actions. Oh right, class. Take care to follow my instructions precisely, as we will be working with volatile chemicals today. No, for you, Glen Coco. You go, Glen Coco. Keep paying attention. I have a wide set vagina and a heavy flow. Okay, I can't do this. Oops. Attention. Do I get more than one shot? Mm -hmm. Keep up the good work. You're almost done. Fascinating, isn't it? Absolutely riveting. Good work. You have a future in chemistry. Fuck yeah. Wait, agents?
Agent never came out. Right? Wasn't Agent the Council Rockstar game? There we go. Done. I wish I could go to school seven days a week. I'm coming for you. Never leave a man behind. Come on, Tansy. Because you love that you basically like cop chase music. Fucking glorious. Hi, girls. No matter where you go, people. Please make out with me. I promise I won't tell. Popularity is one insult. I'm glad. So. Like, uh, stuff? Go, go, go! go. Says, all the Greeks is met in juvenile hall. Hey, doll. Uh, wanna study? Uh, anatomy? Well, Please, don't hurt me. Is it true that you've occasionally sucked your thumb? No, it's true that I occasionally suck my own penis. Okay. So, uh, your place or mine? Your place! Hey, uh, want some loving, baby? You can lick my shoe sole. You're ugly. Hey, you dropped your book. <laughs> Chase music is very stare skin hutch, it is, right? Please make out with me. Uh, words I could never get away with with all the boys at school. Was there a couple of select boys you could, though? I get that. I get that. I think. Smack my bitch up. <laughs> Can't breathe. Oh shit, we're in the wrong place. Oh no, no. The effects are coming for me, baby. I'm truant. Okay. English is. I need your help here, chat. I need your help, alright? Hello, class. The curriculum demands that you do these vocabulary uh, assignments. Why don't you finish them here in class? That way you'll have more free time. Okay. Well done. Uh. That's right. Uh. E Elm. Mole. Show. Mellow. And call it mellow yellow. Oh, wait, Mole would have worked as well, right? That's a good one. Keep it up. Mellow. That's a good one. So, what else do you say? Well. Well, kid. And meow. Meow. Good Whoa. One. Whoa. Whoa. Good one. What about is this a word? I don't think nope. that's in the dictionary. Uh Mo. Good one. Um Oh, wait. Try again, James. I'm afraid that's not English. Leo. Leo. That has to be some sort of slang. Fuck. Owl. Yes. Owl. Spot on, Tartan. This is an interesting game of words with friends. Uh... Try again, James. Owl went in. We got two three letter ones left to go. I think I tried, Lou. Try again, yeah. James.
Emo. Try again, Fuck James. you, game. Try again, James. Good one. one more to go. This is shit. Abel, you fucking king. Good one. Thank you, Abel. Thank you, everyone. But Abel, you fucking saved me there at the end, pal. Thanks for that, buddy. Russell would be barbarian king thousand years ago. Russell would have been barbarian king a thousand years ago. I knew majoring in English would have its uses. Please let me off the hook. Scar's face. All good? <laughs> it was easy. Jim okay, one second, one second, one second. There's something I want to do here, which is I want to turn see the music volume where it is, but, but turn the. Subtitles on, and I want to turn I, I just found it, thankfully, Sid. If you want to scare me, hey, you all right. Hey, doofus McDorquan, how's it going? Hey, yeah. see how tough you are. hey, hey. It's crashed again. Ah! Fuck! Shit balls. Shit balls. The fuck am I gonna do now? God, sorn it. I can't keep like. Okay, there's something seriously wrong with the fucking PC build of this. Fuck, fuckity, fuck, fuck. Fuck, fuckity, fuck. Like I could, could download it and play on emulator and play it on the. I could play it on the PS2 emulator. That is from the series. That's from Arcane. Um. Well, kind of both technically, I guess. But no, it's Arcane because you can see this version of Jinx down here, powder. Um, fuck. I hate when I run into these kind of problems because it's like, on Twitch this is very easy. I can just change game up very easily, but you can't really change things up that easily on YouTube. But I don't really know what else to do here because... Okay, I'm sorry guys. I will return, alright? I'm literally barely at the start, Will. And like, it's crashed. This is its third or fourth time crashing since we've been live an hour and I keep losing the fucking, um, I keep losing my progress because of that. Uh, it's because the Rockstar are notoriously bad with their early PC ports. I have this on PS4 as well, but Kathy's using the, the system. So I'm going to, I'm going to end stream, but I will be back guys. Okay. Just keep your eyes peeled on my. You should get a notification. If not, just keep your eyes peeled. Um, I'm sorry about this, all right? Wait, does YouTube let me? No, 
doesn't let me update. Wait, it does let me update the title. But it doesn't let me update the game or anything. Fuck, okay, no. That's probably it. That's probably it, Abo. Maybe. Although I've literally had no problems with any other fucking games on Windows 11. That would be the first. One sec. No. There is Tartan. I do have another game I could play. The problem is, as they say on YouTube, there's no easy way of updating title, etc. You have to literally log out of everything um, and do it again and like go through it again, unfortunately. That's kind of what I'm getting at, is that like, unfortunately, YouTube doesn't make it fucking easy to do that shit. So... You just have to give me a few minutes. I do apologize, but I will be live again soon with another Rockstar game, okay? Uh, I'm, I'm sorry, folks.